Hi, I'm Alicia Murciano. I'm from the University of Salamanca with Judith Martín, Sara Serrate, Patricia Torrijos, and Barbara Mariana Gutierrez. We will present the research that called Daily Life of Elderly, an approach to the use of your own technology. This work is a part of the actions of a national project about subjective adaptability in technosocial environments and life-based geotechnological technological innovation. We live in a society where technology is now part of pretty much every sphere of our lives. On the one hand, technology brings great benefits to our daily lives, but they are also becoming a necessity for many everyday tasks. This combination of the benefits we are clearly evident in, in certain age groups as the elderly, and the need to include them in everyday life in order, in order not to be left behind is causing older age groups to start using more of these types of technological resources. So we are increased in their participation in the digital culture. However, studies investigating the uses that this age group makes of everyday technology are still lacking. In order to be able to carry out actions to increase digital inclusion in this age group through education and training, it is first necessary to know the reality of this age group. This is the reason because this research through a quantitative design has the aim of collecting information on the different digital technology resources by elderly and to study the most common reasons for using them. The main objectives in this research is understand how other adults use everyday technologies and uncover differences in use by age groups. In addition, it's necessary to understand the main reasons and purpose for which other adults use everyday digital technologies and check differences in reasons of this use by age group. The instrument prepared to collect data was a questionnaire with 25 item liquor type scale in order to collect information on the different resources of digital technologies and also the most common reason for using digital technology. All data were compiled in Excel and analyzed using the SPS statistic program. The same poll considering gender parity and diversity in socioeconomic, academic status and residential and finally, the participation sample is formed of 497 Spanish older adults. In order to study better the differences among the age, participants were divided into three proportional age groups. The results obtained in this study have shown that older adults essentially use technological services and products that facilitate communication and social relationships. While adults over 80 years use especially health-related domains, the younger the subject, 60, 80 years, the more frequently they use domains related to housing and living and communication. Participants generally express that the main reason for using technology is communication, followed by making everyday life more comfortable and easier, but also searching for information and learning. The least important reason is the need to control health-related aspects. But the results showed also that the mean scores are highest in the younger age group, decreased slightly in the second group, and reach the lowest score in the older age group, especially relational with learning and carry out administrative tasks. The results presented in this research allow us to configure one of the main phases in this um, project by focusing in detail on the profile of the use of Giron technological resources of Spanish other adults, paying special attention to the influence of factors such as sales. In this way, this study provides data of pedagogical interest that permit us to understand the use of technology of other adults in their daily life becomes the cornerstone from promoting a use that ensures that they take advantage of the opportunities offered during technology to guarantee and support actions that favor the quality of life. Thank you for your attention.